we used to go street racing, we would meet up on 39th Street at night at Sonic. And this is back when I first met Murder Nova. Actually, I had been on the list longer than him. Anyway, I had met him. We got to be pretty good friends. And he showed up one night up at Sonic. And he had been watching the MMA fights at his house. He showed up up there about midnight. I think he was about half lit. He couldn't remember my name and he kept calling me Monza. Well, everybody heard that and it stuck. So from that point on, I've been Monza, which I'm fine with that. I've been called a hell of a lot worse. <laughs> so it's not, not that big a deal. But, but why did he call you Monza? Because I used to street race a Monza when Brandon was 13. I had decided I wanted to do something with my son, get him into racing cars, and keep him off of drugs and stupid bullshit that I had done when I was young. So I traded my cousin a truck for this little Monza body, and at the time I worked at a place called James Overhead Door, and a lady named Kim Leeskamp owned it, and her husband Roger used to build sprint cars. So he could fabricate anything. So I was actually the shop supervisor, shop foreman, whatever the hell you want to call it there. I didn't actually work on the doors anymore. I ran the cruise. I went and bought that car. Roger had a big shop there. Took it up there and Roger commenced to helping me build that car. My buddy Jeremy and El Reno built me a motor and we our goal was to have an uh, 11 second car and the very first time out with it we ran 1180s and on motor and we put nitrous on it and it went 1040s and then it had a little 355 small block Chevy in it and then from that point on we never looked back we just started going faster and faster.
on that. Who won it? Monza.